and welcome back to my channel, Be Delicious Budgeting. My name is Anna, so today we're doing a different type of video. On my Instagram polls, you all voted for me to do a closet declutter. I was hoping to push that off, but hey, if that's what you want to see, that is what you'll get. So if you're not following me on Instagram, definitely do so, so you can participate in what type of videos you all want to see. And as always, Marshmallow and Coco are nearby filming, so they're going to help us out today. And I have been wanting to get rid of a few things just because they don't fit me anymore. They're just kind of out of style. I even have things from high school that I still fit, but it's not in style. So I just definitely need to part ways and throw it out and then find stuff that like flatter me now and just, you know, growing our bodies change. So we're going to declutter my closet and I plan on giving the clothes away to family and friends. So one thing about me, I don't like being wasteful at all, so I can't just like throw clothes out away. Like before COVID, I would like donate it to donation bins or to Goodwill. I have some thrift shops here that you can sell clothes for money, so it either has to be put to some good use or like the item has to be like super like damaged or stained for me to throw it out because I just hate being wasteful and want to be put to good use. So if you're interested in seeing my closet, stay tuned. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I upload twice a week, every Wednesday and Saturday. And if you haven't already, please hit the subscribe button down below. Let's give this video a thumbs up and let's go ahead and declutter my closet. So I must say I do have a lot of clothes. I have it color coordinated. So this is like my winter stuff right now. And I got these wooden hangers from Ikea actually. They're like the best value. I seen some at Burlington and Ross, but I like everything to match. So I was scared I wouldn't find enough because I had to buy a ton of these at Ikea. I think you like an eight pack for $6. I'll have that linked down below. And then up here, I just have my jeans, my capris, and then I got this bin from Dollar Tree like for my wallets and stuff. And these are like my more fancy shoes. I have to show you all our bed frame too because it is super cool. We got it at Home Depot, so that's also storage as well, which I really like. And I, it was pretty affordable too and it doesn't take much space. So if you live in a small space area, which we used to live in an apartment, so this was definitely very helpful. Also, we got a new dresser because my husband and I each had our own dresser and that was just kind of silly. And we consolidated into one. We got it from Ikea. It was like right under $200, maybe like $220 at the most, but definitely fits a lot and their organizers are bomb. So I'll have that all linked down below. It's all from Ikea, like all of our furniture is from Ikea. This is absolutely gorgeous. It's a little dress. However, it does not flatter me well, so I will be donating this. Well, I really like this flannel. However, again, it's a little short and kind of shrunk over the years. I had this since my early college days. I actually wore it in my Five Below haul video. I'll have that listed above if you're interested. It's really pretty, but I think I became more so into the oversized flannel. So I'd really like to find something else that I feel more comfortable in. So I'll be donating this as well. I'm like super picky when it comes to clothes because one, it has to be like affordable because I'm all about deals here and then two it has to fit me right so it's kind of hard for me to get rid of clothes because one I don't like trying clothes on and especially with COVID I don't want to bring it home and have to return it or you can't return it I don't know it's just too much of a hassle for me like Old Navy is like the only place we can try on clothes right now which I like I haven't really been buying clothes too much and then jeans Oh, just for, forget about it. I hate shopping for pants. That's like the worst. I hate wearing jeans. I love my sweatpants and my leggings. So working from home has been a blessing because I've been able to do so. So I'm kind of debating about this one because it is a pink shirt by Victoria's Secret. It still fits and everything. However, again, I just feel like it's more of a younger vibe. So I'm just gonna kind of think on it and just put it aside in my pile. And then I have these pair of jeans I just don't wear anymore. So I'm gonna be donating these as well. I remember wearing this on my 22nd birthday. So I did wear a bandeau under it because that is way too low cut. No one needs to be seeing all that. So this is really cute, but obviously I ain't going to clubs anytime soon. Or It's funny, like when I was 18, I remember like, oh, when I turn 21, I'm gonna go to the clubs and all that. Clubs are so awkward. Like you either have to be like dancing or drinking the whole time. Can't really like talk to anyone. And it's funny because I got engaged at 21. So instead of like parring it up like I thought I would be, I settled down. And I'll be getting rid of this Coca-Cola t-shirt. So I like it, but it's just a little running short on me. So again, like, when I raise my hand or something, you'll see my stomach. No one needs to be seeing all that. I have this other Coca-Cola shirt. I really like it a lot. It's not stained. That's just like the design. Again, it's kind of running short on me and I feel like it's a little young. So I'm just trying to go for a more mature look. And these shorts, 
no, we're we're just not gonna fit in those again. I used to love this flannel. So I like flannels. Again, it's running a little bit short on me. This one's so comfy though. I absolutely love it, but I'll be giving this away as well. I was so mad at myself for this one because I just bought it. So I have one in black as well, but I accidentally like shrunk it. So yeah, it it does not. You can't even tell, but it does not fit me. Like it just went to like a baby size t-shirt. So I'll be giving this to my younger cousin. Hopefully she likes friends. But yeah, I like bought this brand new and then I washed it. I was like, oh my God, I shrunk. I'm not I'm not wearing that. Oh, this shirt's so pretty, but it did a total 180 on me. Like I kept washing it, wearing it. Not be wearing this doesn't flatter me. Literally, I only like go through like the same two or three pairs of jeans because I don't even want to try on the other one. So I actually found these Nine West one at Ross. They were only like $12. So I was like, heck yeah, they're a little baggy though. But I was like, Psh, Nine West for $12, sign me up. And I'm gonna be giving away these pair of jeans. So they actually fit. I wore them the other day and I don't know, I just don't like the shape of them anymore. I think they're a straight jean or kind of like a little flared. So I like more of a skinny jean. I forgot I had these jeans. Like I said, I just wear like the top two or three just cause I'm lazy. But I got these at Rue 21. They're super cute. They were $3 and they fit amazing. I don't know why I don't wear these more. I'm definitely keeping these. Yeah, I don't even remember the last time I wore these, so I will definitely be giving these away. It's an old navy brand. So I actually saw some. I went to H&M the other day. They had so many cute clothes, but again, since I can't try it on, I don't want to deal with all that. It's like a high-low sweater, so I was trying to go like up a size or two because it was a little longer in length, but then it looked more wide, and that's not cute on me either. So I was just like, oh, forget it. I'm not getting anything. But they had jeans for $10, and I do have a pair of their jeans and they have like something like this color and then black but I'll be giving this away and then once we can try on clothes I'll just get another pair from there. just have these capri pants and I actually found these American Eagle ones at this place called Plato's Closet so I actually went to Reno, Nevada. It's like this really cool thrift store and they have like really trendy clothes, a brand name and these are like 10 bucks or so and they fit really nicely so I like these a lot and then I got these from that thrift store. I don't know, it's royalty or something brand. I think these are like six dollars or something like that. So yeah, I really like when we go up there. It's like a few hour drive from here, but not too bad and really easy, hardly any traffic. But I really like that thrift store a lot. I actually got most of my like pink Victoria's Secret stuff from there because they're expensive. Okay, so I was really mad about this one because I haven't even worn these. I got these from Burlington. They were $10 and it said size 8 on there, which I'm always a size 8 in shoes. And like they do not fit me at all. So I can't even wear them and they're brand new, super pretty. So I'm going to be seeing if someone else wants them. Also, I remember I got these for when my husband and I first went to Las Vegas. I got these at Dee Dee's Discounts, which is kind of like a Ross, but cheaper. I got these for $10, but these heels are super uncomfortable, so not for me. I actually got like a thicker wedge. I actually got these from Fashion Nova. They were like $30, $20, but they're so comfortable. Like I can wear them all day, not a problem, and they're super cute. Just a disclaimer, this isn't going to be like a huge declutter. Like I don't have like that many clothes to give out, but definitely a few that I just have to part ways with. It wasn't them, it was me. Oh, Marshmallow fell asleep. He's so cute. They're always here when I'm filming. And then Coco just wants me to hold her. Huh, Cocos? He's just so cute. And this is the dresser that I was talking about from Ikea. It actually fits a lot. Like I said, my husband and I both each had our own dresser. And we consolidated into one and we still have room. So my top drawer is like my pajamas. And then this is just kind of like my graphic tees and like my shorts and swimsuits. So I don't use this side too much because we're in winter here. So I actually love these from Ikea. You get like a five or a six pack for $5 and they're really nice quality. I just have like my tank tops in here. So it actually fits a bunch and these drawers are really deep as well and you can fit a lot. And down here is just where all my sweatpants live, which I am definitely not getting rid of those. Those are like all I live in now. So we're definitely keeping those. So this was a cool thing I was talking about. So I just have my gym clothes in here. So this is like part of our bed frame, I guess you can call it. So it has some drawers and they're really deep and nice. And I just have the Ikea dividers. 
So I just have my like capri workout stuff, my shorts, and then my sports bras, my tank tops, and then like my workout shirt. So I just keep it all in here. I just like my socks and underwear, which I'm not gonna show on here. Over there's my summer pajamas, which I'll be keeping all of those because I just went through those recently. So now we're in my glam room closet. So this is like my summer clothes and like my formal clothes I keep in here. I tried putting it all in there, but it's just like too much. And also we have to fit my husband's clothes in there. I have these little hangers in this one. So whenever like I swap out, so like when it's summertime, this stuff will go in the bedroom and then that stuff will come in here. Here's just kind of make it a lot more organized. I found these at Frost. I think they're like $6.99 for maybe like 10 of these. So it holds like 50 pieces of clothing. I remember buying this when I was like 20 or 21 years old. It's really pretty. It's flowy. It still fits. I remember wearing like a white bandeau underneath it. However, again, I just feel too old for this. So I'll be seeing if my cousin wants it. She's young. She could definitely get away with wearing this. I remember getting this at H&M like last year or two years ago. It was three dollars. Really cute, but it kind of has like a tighter like fabric to it, which I don't like. So I'll be giving this away as well. And I've had this for years. I remember getting it at Ross. I'm just like not feeling it anymore, nor have I worn it in a while. I remember buying this at Plato's Closet, that thrift store I was talking about in Reno. So they have some in like California as well, like Long Beach, Modesto, but those are kind of like far from me. So this is really cute. I just haven't seen myself wearing it in a while, like pre-COVID. So it's been like over a year or so. I really love this dress. Like I would wear this all the time, but just it flat out just doesn't fit me anymore, just to be honest. So good riddance. This one's a really pretty dress. I actually like it a lot. However, the button came off in the back so when i like pin it it goes up higher so it kind of looks like a high water on me so the link's a little off I'm seeing if my cousin wants it she's a little shorter than i am so i think i'll look better on her back to my bedroom and then show you all what i'm getting rid of i mean like i said it's not like a huge declutter but you know i still feel good about getting rid of some things i absolutely like don't wear just don't fit me right so we're gonna head back over there it's a little neat trick so if you have an old shoe box so i have this old nike shoe box it's great to store like your sandals and flip-flops in and doesn't take as much room and also i'm getting rid of this because it is just way too small on me i decided i'm going to keep this pink shirt because it is cozy and i do like it a lot so i am gonna keep it i'm giving away three pairs of jeans good riddance if it was up to me, I would never wear jeans again. I would just be all jeggings, leggings, and sweatpants, to be honest. So that was it for my closet declutter. I actually ended up giving away a lot more than I was expecting, which honestly feels amazing because I'm making space for things that I feel comfortable in. So I really look forward to that and it does feel good. So let me know in the comment box down below if these are videos you like to see or if this inspired you to go through your closet and make way for some new things and get rid of the old things you're not wearing anymore. I definitely love to know. Also, let's give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please hit the subscribe button down below and I'll see you all in my upcoming videos. Bye everyone.